All right, let's talk about Lil Uzi Vert claiming that he is going back to his old sound for Love is Rage 3 because I feel like since Love is Rage 3 is part of his flagship series of albums, he really popularized himself with the Love is Rage and then more importantly, the debut studio album with Exo Tour Life, 20 Minutes, among other popular hits, Love is Rage 2. Like, of course, he's going to go back to this sound because if he's about to retire, then why not go out with a bang? So I think this is a good move, but... He does happen to say this every single album. So like, such as even before Pink Tape, he was previewing a bunch of snippets, a couple of them actually sounding like they almost came from 2017-ish era or even before like 2015. There's this one snippet that I can't even find anymore. He had like purple hair at his crib previewing. I don't know, it, it's my all time favorite snippet. It's not a grail or anything for, I guess the, the masses of his fan base, but still, I'm just saying, I love the old sound of Lil Uzi Vert, and I don't necessarily want him to not evolve, but like, come on. That sound is overwhelmingly the type of music that the fans want. And I feel like a lot of people will defend him being like, no, we want Uzi to evolve because every single artist gets this one statement from the fans, like, go back to the old you. And I understand that artists might get like bored with a certain sound that they did while they were like 21 years old or so. And now Uzi's like 27, 28. So maybe it just feels wrong for him. And he's not necessarily doing the same amount of drugs, all the Zans and the lean. So maybe he can't just get into that mode, but still, I think with certain artists, there is actually merit behind fans wanting the old sound because that is how they got popular in the first place. And I know Uzi got like, just wanna rock among other, big hits. You can't tell me Just Wanna Rock is like one of his greatest hits. Yes, it blew up off TikTok, but like it's not even a real song. It's just like a, a dance club meme type song, in my opinion. I'm not hating at all. You know, it's decent, but like it's just not something that I listen to in my free time. But anyway, enough of me yapping. Let's see what Lil Uzi Vert had to say himself. And don't get me wrong, like the songs I'm making and shit, like all of that. All that shit is cool, but I'm getting back to my original shit. Okay, again, he does say this every single album, but y'all heard the crowd when he said that he's going back to the old sound, his original shit, quote unquote. Like, obviously that is in high demand. And honestly, I hate when a lot of fans be like, no, let him evolve. Like, nah, bro, that was the evolved music. The newer shit to me sounds a little bit, not dumbed down, but like sounds more conformed to every other rapper's type of music. And that's what they say about like a lot of rappers going pop because they almost have to conform to hit the bigger masses of fans. Cause let's be honest, most people just don't know what good music is. All they do is go on Rap Caviar or other playlists on Apple Music and just listen to whatever big rapper they put on the playlist. They're all sheep. But nah, I'm just saying, us real fans that have been here since like 2016 or something, we know what actual good music from Uzi is. Not that he makes bad music now, but like, that was the peak. There's a reason that to this day, people still regard Love Is Rage 2 as one of his best albums, if not the best album. I rated like a nine, 9.5 out of 10. Like it was, it's just a whole vibe. I can listen to it straight through the entire time. And I can do that for Eternal Take, maybe not some of the newer ones, but that's really when he was in his bag, in my opinion, of course. But as always, it's not up to me. Y'all let me know in the comments. Do you want Uzi to go back to the old sound or do you want him to doing different types of music, almost like he did on Pink Tape with experimenting with the rock music? I personally didn't think it was it, but hey, maybe that's what's some people are looking for. I don't know. It's been your boy Bob Lim signing off. Happy Thanksgiving. Peace out, cloud people.